Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. Coronation Street fans switch off as Roy Croppers refused bail in awful twist. Coronation Street's Lauren Bolton disappeared in February and the police have decided that she has been murdered even though there is no body. Coronation Street viewers watched aghast as the Lauren Bolton played by Kate Fitton murder storyline took yet another twist while Roy Cropper David Nielsen continued to be the chief suspect and was refused bail on the latest episode of the ITV soap. Despite Dee Dee Bailey's Shannock Sterling Brown best efforts, the CPS barrister painted Roy as a murderer with a violent past and listed his crimes including an assault on Gary Windass Mikey North and the abduction of one of his foster children. This was enough to ensure that he was refused bail and as his friends decried the decision he was led back to his lonely cell. His lonely predicament was compounded when he used his one phone call to ring the only number he knows, the landline at the cafe. Unfortunately, None of his supporters were there as they were in the rover's return. Viewers were outraged and took to X, formerly known as Twitter threatening to stop watching if the storyline didn't end. At Leah Allen 77 fumed, seriously Corey come off it Roy wouldn't he hurt a fly. Another viewer referred back to another famous miscarriage of justice on the street writing, seriously Corey are we doing a Deirdre on Roy Cropper? Enough of this I say in an authoritarian tone. Enough. Coronation Street Free Roy At Kakakalaka J inquired, anyone else switching off Corey whilst this Roy travesty is airing at Klongwa commented, this episode is depressing. Roy was put in prison. Now they all missed his one phone call. This is awful. I don't care where Lauren is. Roy Cropper deserves better. It's so sad. Corey. Stevie Oib 23271 chimed in, I know it's a soap, but refusing Roy bail. No body, very dodgy circumstantial evidence. I mean fingerprints on a condom. Sick. Meanwhile, at Blum's house pointed out that the police on the show don't have a good track record writing, DS Swain ISNT very good at her job is she wrongly gets Kelly sent to prison for Seb's death, couldn't he help Amy, didn't he do anything about the racists until Alia was stabbed, and now she s sent Roy to prison. Corey. Roy's imprisonment led to a crisis of conscience for Bobby Crawford Jack Carroll who took it upon himself to rethink his statement to the police. However, his aunt Carla Connor Allison King wasn't impressed that he had used her name as part of his story and it could be a case that he has made things worse. Elsewhere in the episode, Adam Barlow Sam Robinson met up with a potential new client and things took a romantic turn. Alia Nair Khan was not impressed with his action and after receiving an offer from elsewhere she quit her job. Sarah Barlow Tina O'Brien learned about Maria Connor's Samai Long Chamban hidden camera and import Gary Windass to delete the footage of her drunken pass at him. And Leanne Battersby Jane Danson fell deeper under the spell of the Alto Valent Institute.